Sanger sequencing has been the foundation and gold standard of DNA sequencing since 1977. While new sequencing technologies have emerged since, Sanger is still an invaluable tool for all kinds of labs. The basic steps of Sanger sequencing are simple. The reaction involves template DNA, a primer, DNA polymerase, nucleotides, and fluorescently labeled dideoxynucleotides. First, the DNA is denatured and then cooled to allow the primer to bind. The DNA polymerase enzyme then lengthens the strand according to the DNA template until it randomly places a dideoxynucleotide. The dideoxynucleotide is missing the hydroxyl group, which allows the next nucleotide to bind. So once it is placed, the chain is terminated and will not grow any longer. The color of the fluorescent dye on the dideoxynucleotide represents the last base which was added to that fragment. This reaction is repeated until the sample contains the fragments of all different lengths, each terminated by a fluorescently labeled dideoxynucleotide. When the fragments are separated by size, the dyes can be read in order to give the sequence of the template DNA.